Hey everyone, welcome to the heart of mainstream Bali. We're in Changu today, beautiful sunny day, towards the end of rainy season hopefully here. So if you're just joining us now and haven't seen our videos before, I'm Trevor with Bali Texture and as Bali Texture's lead villa enthusiast, take you around some of the most amazing luxury villas and resorts that Bali has to offer. Uh, because these villas are awesome and basically to get you excited about coming out to Bali after this pandemic stuff is all over and enjoy it. So today we're at Villa Boa and this is the best villa to be next to the beach enjoying the sun. Before we get started, make sure and like and subscribe. It helps us rank in Google. Thanks. So Villa Boa is a three bedroom, four bathroom villa. And it's part of a villa complex called the Changu Beachside Villas, which you've seen a couple of these before. Villa Gu is one, and then Villa Vida is another. And these villas, uh, they're all incredible. They're all custom, completely unique, and offer that wow factor. And they're all also very close to each other, so they're perfect for large events. If you wanna come out, have 20 people, uh, all hanging out in some incredibly luxurious villas here. So follow me first, uh, let's enjoy the wow factor here. And I'm uh, greeted with a welcome drink. This villa is exclusively managed by the Lux Nomad who gives amazing service. How are you? Thank you so much, yes. Oh, I'll definitely take the refreshing towel today. It's a little hot, but it's worth it. So thank you so much. Like I see, yeah. Villa Boa is uh, a perfect, I mean, just perfectly designed indoor outdoor concept where we've got a really amazing uh, flow of space. Uh, what I really like about the Changu beachside villas is that they all have the same feel. Uh, it's very modern, it's very hip. We've got lots of pops of color, but we also have a, some amazing art pieces in each of these villas. Uh, the wood sculptures, the paintings and the pictures, it just, you know, there's something to look at always uh, where we really feel like the design element has been taken to the next level. But the best part is the, the I love this indoor outdoor concept. We've got a 16 meter pool in front here. Plenty big to do a pool test pretty soon here. And then, um, and then we actually have three stories. So we've got the master bedroom upstairs and then the two other bedrooms here downstairs. Let's talk about the dining area. We've got a couple places to lounge and everything here is to be able to socialize. The way it's designed is to be able to relax in different parts, have a different experience wherever you're sitting and always get those main components of the best villa experience, which is garden, water features, space. We've got really high ceilings here, modern design. I, I love the lampshades here, but also we've got uh, water features So let's go ahead and head upstairs to the master bedroom and give a look. All right, coming into the master bedroom here. Just, you know, we're, we're definitely having exclusive space here. Nice high ceilings cement back wall, nice big bathroom. <laughs> you know, uh, but you know, before I even talk about these features, I really like that we've got a huge private deck here with the spiral staircase. Uh, again, it just gives us a, a nice sense of space and to be able to look out and see the garden too. So uh, this is a really open concept bedroom that we have an ensuite bathroom that is just right here with a partition curtain if needed. But I like it, I like the, uh, the color that they put in here with the baboons or gibbons, baboons or gibbons. Is this a baboon or a gibbon? Comment below and I'll Google search it later. But we also have, as is the iconic feature that you have to have in all villas in Bali, nice big stone tub and a nice big shower. I like the little lounge area here. Uh, for the wardrobe also so really nice you know a proper proper place to get dressed 
let's go ahead, while we're here, let's go ahead and head up to the third floor and uh, get a nice sense of the view here. Ah, oh, feels good up here, nice breeze. We've got a sitting area, so couch and a couple chairs, but I love these rooftops. The Changu Beachside Villas, when you're on a rooftop like this on a third level, you can see how many villas don't have rooftops. Um, so we've got ocean view in front and on a clear day, which we've got some clouds coming in, uh, but we certainly can get a volcano view from here as well and see Mount Agung, how it really makes it uh, feel like you're somewhere else when you can see a volcano and the ocean at the same time from your third story rooftop luxury villa deck. All right, heading into this guest bedroom, you know, we see feathers on the wall. There's, we have a similar feel to the design elements, but it's still different than uh, exactly what we find in the living rooms and the other bedroom. Pretty straightforward, nice queen size bed, and then looks out to the pool. We've got blackout curtains and then an ensuite bathroom. But as, as we hope to find always is there's still this flow of flow. <laughs> it's just, there's just flow everywhere. And we've got the window behind the mirrors here, which we've seen in several other villas that you're reminded that you're surrounded by the garden here. So there's still uh, so much, there's still so many elements of nature combining with your living area here. All right, now just next door to this bedroom, is the final guest bedroom. So just like the other one, we've got yeah, a large wall of glass here, double sliding doors that looks out to the pool. This one has twin beds, so it's nice for a kid's room and it's got a, a graffitied surfboard here, so a little different vibe to this room than the others. But ensuite bathroom right here. Again, big shower. Now we don't see the big stone tub in this bedroom but at least we see it in the other ones. And then just around the corner here, we've got the wardrobe area and a toilet. Now this pool, like so many villas, is certainly the centerpiece. So I, I am looking forward to doing a, a pool test. It's a little warm out here. You know, with these open concept villas, I think that it's, an, it's a true experience that you don't get to to really have with a lot of other accommodations around the world. But I'm always conflicted where sometimes I really like the closed living area type villas because it's a little cooler. We've got a little more air conditioning, but this open concept I really like too, where you just you really have a, have a whole different experience with it. I'm curious your thoughts below. Do you think that you would like a open concept villa or something that's a little more closed, maybe a little cooler during the daytime, but gives us a good excuse to jump in the pool. Ah, that felt great. We haven't done a pool test in a couple of villas worth. We've been in the mountains, so uh, that felt good. It felt like I stuck the landing, but I'll let you be the judge of that. Comment below. Again, a very special thank you to the Lux Nomad and getting to tour Villa Boa today. If you're interested in booking Villa Boa, we'll leave a link below where you can get in touch for some more information. And if you're interested in investing in villas in Bali, you don't have to be here to do that either. Uh, we can help you with developments as well as real estate investing. We'll leave a link below where you can contact us for some more information as well. So make sure and like and subscribe before we head out here. I'll see you again.